YouTube. It's Mitch at iPhoneCaptain.com. Today we're going to be doing a video for you showing you how you can recover lost files, lost messages, pictures, anything on your iOS device. And I just want to preface this with this video is not supported, is not supported by anyone. I'm doing this completely because I feel like this is an important software and can truly help my viewers and readers on iPhoneCaptain.com. Once again, this is not a sponsored post or video. Now, on with that, uh, what we're going to be looking at today is called Dr. Phone. Now, this is with an F, P-H, I'm sorry, not P-H, F-O-N-E. Uh, it's a truly awesome little tool and one you're going to get a lot of use of. Now, that being said, uh, we're here on the Dr. Phone website, and it's drphone.wondershare.com. Well, all these links will be in the description below. And as you can see here, it says it is iOS 10 compatible. They have 2,605 reviews, guys, and they have five stars. So what does that tell you? Like I've always said, we leave the bull at the door here at iPhone Captain. If this was no good, I wouldn't be doing and wasting my time with you doing this. But I get a lot of emails, people asking me how they can recover this or recover that. Guys, here's a tool that does every single thing you need it to do. They answer all your questions here on their website. They have uh, guides that will walk you through step by step. And you can do a lot of things using this tool free. However, I'm going to say most of you but will be wanting to buy this once you use it just a little bit. Now, if you do decide to use it, you can see right here that it ranges anywhere from 29 uh, or I'm sorry, 1995 looks like up to around 6995. Now, it is available also for Android devices, so they have you covered on a lot of different spectrums here, guys. But the one we're looking at today is for the iOS and this is the Dr. Phone. And we're going to be using iOS right here, the Dr. Phone version. And I'm going to share with you what it looks like inside. Here when you go inside, the first thing you're going to be asked to do when you connect your device is you're going to have to actually uh, run a scan. It's going to scan your device. And as you can see here, I had 3,412 photos. Who takes that many pictures, guys? This this is unfreaking believable. I mean, I thought I was a, a, a some kind of a photo nympho or something. But anyway, I have 3,400 photos in on my device and in iCloud. And that's another thing; it backs up iCloud. Uh, truly a remarkable thing. But here's the part I know you're probably wanting to get to is the messages. A lot of you get pissed off at your girlfriends. I'm quitting the bitch. I'm never going to have anything else to do with her. You delete everything, all the photo, all the naked pics you have of her, all the bad photos uh, and the messages that she sent you, and uh-oh, you get back together. So you need all this shit back. So what do you do now? How are you going to get those naughty pics back? You're going to use Dr. Phone. Dr. Phone is going to get those naked pics back for you guys. It's going to get those phone numbers you need. If, you, if your girlfriend finds out that you've got some contacts in there from old when, or older girlfriends you used to have, or maybe you've got some you're getting on the side, and she deletes them, how are you going to get them back? You know, nobody remembers a phone number these days with the way you enter it into your phone. All you ever see is the contact name and the, num the picture of the person that's calling on your phone. You never see numbers, so you don't remember this kind of stuff. So how do you remember that? Dr. Phone. Dr. Phone's got you covered on all this, guys. Any kind of message attachments you've gotten uh, through different messages you've received. Uh, here's your contacts. Uh, call history. Now, that could get you in a little bit of trouble. Now, if you want to look at your girlfriend's phone, take it home or something like that and run a little scan on it, then you can come back and pull up her call history and see what she's been doing, too. You know, it goes both ways here. Awesome tool, guys. Notes, notes, attachments, calendars, reminders, anything that's ever been in this phone, is a you're able to get it out. That's what I have preached so much to people I know. 
don't send naked photos of your junk or your girlfriend have your girlfriend send you a picture of her junk anybody gets this phone can get this up unless you restore it now if you just refer do that back to factory settings shit i mean you know that's not that big a deal but you have to do a complete erase restore to make sure everything's gone but anyway that's another video this is getting a little bit long too and i didn't want it to do that but guys all you have to do is come in here okay we're going to, we're going to it says it's still uh running do you wish to uh exit and we're going to go ahead and exit out of here so if we wanted to uh restore something all we would have to do is, get, is come in here and do a system recovery it can recover your device to normal operations from any of the following scenarios uh if it's uh the latest version you can unlock devices that will be relocked jailbroken devices can be restored to non-jailbroken state which that's not that big a deal i mean you can do all that without this without this tool but what i'm telling you guys is you can actually uh use this to actually uh restore and recover data so what we're going to do is your deleted data from the device and we're going to only choose a couple things because it takes so long this is complete nits up analyzing process here as you can see here on the left side you can recover this directly from the device you can also recover it from the itunes backup that you have saved on your computer and you can recover it from iCloud so you got three options to recover stuff from so out of those three options you're going to be assured that you're going to get what it is you need and as you can see here it says it do not disconnect while the device is uh, running and so now it's performing another test and scanning my device and it says we have about 15 minutes remaining so when we, when we finish I'll come well nope it's not gonna take that long like I said I only pulled up the uh, messages and and as you can see here uh, it's pulling up old old stuff guys I haven't seen uh, these photos here in, in years so we're going here and we're going to choose messages and as you can see here it's the recovered messages are in orange which makes them stand out and you can even it even goes so far as to pull up the co actual conversation guys so if you need to know what a conversation was all you have to do is run this scan pull it up and right down here it says you can even restore it to your device if you want to or you can re export it to your mac to save and maybe send it to whoever it is you're wanting to uh, share the information with so much you can do here guys and in the contacts you see i have 4,000 contacts uh um, just a number of things this is helpful for uh businesses personal use just any way you can imagine you can use recovering your old data there's just some time you're going to need it i promise you you will need it and you can do like i said a great deal with the free version but updating is going to up the upgrade for 29 or 39 dollars is definitely worth it uh, i recommend doing it so check it out you also got a ios private data eraser here uh at 100 percent erases it says your device nothing recoverable like i said if you do those naked photos and then you sell your uh iphone you can come in here erase it that way you know nobody's going to get photographs of you or your girlfriend uh, of your junk. So be sure, guys, to, to come in here and erase that out of there. Guys, if you aren't a subscriber, hit that subscribe button, share this video, let me know what you think. Are you gonna use this tool, or are you gonna stop taking photos of your junk? Let us know in the comment section. Hit that subscribe button button, share it on Facebook and Twitter, and keep coming back.